this here is going to be our uh, martial arts training. So you can see the way it maneuvers. It's actually pretty cool for what it is. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to an all new episode of Conflicts. We are here in our studio checking out Optimus Prime, the Robison humanoid robot, as well as his trailer kit, and giving you a little sneak peek in terms of what it can do. Now, if you haven't seen the video before, I do go into terms of full detail in terms of unboxing it. This here's a 360 video, so we're actually in a room here where we can kind of showcase exactly what it can do, how it controls, and then kind of give you a little bit of preview of how it feels to actually be there. So right now I have the Optimus Prime uh, robotic kit right here, as well as the trailer kit, and then also the vehicle that comes with the trailer kit. Now there is an app, so let's go ahead and open that up. This here is gonna be our main hub. So you can actually see that right over here. So over here you have a few different things. You have actions, create, remote control, and missions. Now under remote control, this allows you to control just about everything. For instance, if we have our robot right over here, uh, I can control the Optimus Prime and kind of control him around and just drive him around like this. Which is actually pretty cool. So you can go ahead and just drive him around and do your own thing. Now you can even transform him by pressing a button here. And in a matter of seconds, he'll go ahead and transform into the humanoid robot state. <laughs> now I can have him move around. Let's go. And then I can do a bit of different actions and essentially control it just like that. Now, other than that, we also have our trailer kit, which is this guy right over here. So this is part of the humanoid robot, uh, allowing to go ahead and control them simultaneously together. So if I want, I can have uh, the car itself control as an RC car too. So I can control that about, move them around, and just do just about anything with it in terms of controlling it. But you can also go ahead and transform this into a battle state. For instance, if I click this button here, So this is pretty cool. So over here you can actually see there's a few different things going on. You have a control unit over here that you can also control too. So if I bring that up here. Now you can control everything at once. I can move Optimus there. I can move the vehicle over here. And then I can even go ahead and control this part over here as well all at the same time. And it's actually kind of cool on how they do that. So you can go ahead and control just about everything at once. Now these things work simultaneously together, which is absolutely cool. Now going back into the uh, regular state here, let's go and put this back down. Yep. <laughs> there we are. So I can put this back into the trailer set and then I can transform Optimus back into its vehicle set. And to kind of showcase how they kind of work together, what I'll do is I'll take Optimus over here and then I'll take the trailer kit right over here. And this will just kind of slide right into play. So there's like a little notch that just kind of like falls into it, just like that. And then from there, uh, I can go ahead and drive it. <laughs> How cool is that? So overall, it's actually pretty cool. Uh, and then you can go ahead and technically transform both of them at the same time. So for instance, if I just go ahead and raise it up just like this, there we are. I can now have Optimus get out of there. And then I can have Optimus transform. And then I can go ahead and have this also move up to all at the same time. So overall, a pretty cool concept. Now, let's go ahead and just grab Optimus here for a quick second and bring him back over here in the center. Kind of demo some of the moves that he has. Uh, so if I go back to freestyle mode, click back, um, I can go into actions. Now, these are different actions that Optimus has. So for instance, if I click on fight, we'll kind of showcase like a fight move. Like he's blocking. <laughs> And then you have like uh, calling all often. Different like animations from the show. Fate rarely calls upon us in a moment of our choosing. 
And if I click on download more, I can actually find different animations that they've uploaded online. So there's like Kung Fu Master, uh, there's Fighting Skill, there's Martial Arts Training, Boxing Champion, uh, Exercise. So for instance, this here is gonna be Kung Fu or Martial Arts Training. Uh, so I can just download that really quick and then I can play it and demo it to you guys literally in a matter of seconds. So try now. And now it's, this here is gonna be our uh, martial arts training. So you can see the way it maneuvers. It's actually pretty cool for what it is. Now I've reviewed a lot of humanoid robots and I have to say this here is definitely state of the art and something very unique in terms of the humanoid robot aspect goes. Now Robeson is definitely upping up their game and creating some very unique robots just like this and they have some cool things coming in the future including uh, Buzz Lightyear and some other cool ones as well in terms of Transformers too going forward. Now, with that said, definitely a very cool robot. Again, you can control it as a remote control. You can do actions. Um, you can even go and create your own animations and different customized blocks. So if I click on customize here, I click on plus, and then I click start. Now this loosens all the servos. I'll bring it to a position that I like like this, and then I'll hit sync, and I'll show it right there. I'll add it, bring it back down, sync, add it, uh, then do another one. Let's do something like this. Sync. Add it. And then if I play, it should play it just like that. So just like that, I was able to go and create my own animations. Um, I can add audio. I can uh, create my own dances and stuff like that, which is absolutely cool in terms of humanoid robots goes. That it does give you that capability. You now you also have your block base, so you can technically do drag and drop and create your own animations and based off of that. So overall, I have to say it's definitely a great robot in terms of education as well as entertainment wise. There's a lot of playback value. Now, granted, the price is quite steep. I have to let you guys know that a lot of these humanoid robots are very very expensive and this particular robot for the price is actually significantly cheaper than some of these other robots I previously reviewed now majority of the pricing comes from the servos itself the servos are very expensive now these particular robot have a lot of different servos as you can already mention uh, however they're actually very durable meaning they don't damage they don't get stuck they don't lock up uh, and that's a common issue among a lot of other fighting human robots again this year's more of an entertainment base and if you're in the market for something like this this, definitely very cool really unique thing to show uh, if you want something to add on the trailer kit is definitely a great way to go too and with that said if you have any questions comment down below otherwise see you guys next time take care now bye bye